Mook. Move up higher when they said pick and roll. Step up higher. Good move. You're too high, Brooke. Bella, if Brooke is standing like this with the ball and looking to pass it, attack her. She, she, nobody can make a move from here. So unless she's down low, attack her. Pick and roll. Come close enough that you can hear, Precious. Make sure you can hear what Tom is saying. Good move. Make contact when a shot goes up. Good shot, Chloe. Where to stay with it. Savannah, you have to come out and put make contact on the box out. shot. Good move. So, but Zoe, once she caught it, you didn't react out to it fast. You got down because you didn't get it right away. There's still another play. The next play is important. Get to the next play. Nice move. Catch it first. Get to the rim. That's a nice shot, but you... Precious. Listen to Tom right now. I would push her to the left. Precious, good pass, but you score in there.
Excellent move, Bella. But on defense, the last time you were back into the habit of having your hands on your side. You have to be active with your hands. Good move. See, see, one second. This is a great matchup for you two. You're not going to find another player as talented as each other. So if one of you can play harder yet, you raise the ceiling. Now the other girl, can she play that hard or harder yet? Well, now she raises the ceiling. And back and forth it goes. It's by playing and competing against the best players that you have a chance to improve. But the operative word is competing. Okay. You might freeze it, but that's a nice shot. See, you can you can keep doing what I tell, opposite of what I tell you to do, or you can try. It. You don't challenge the shot. You don't yell at. It. I think Grace Kinnaman improved her game when she started following my guidance on that. Your game's going to stay the same on that situation until you change it. It's not going to change magically. And she can shoot over the right time. Sprint there. Both hands straight up. Move back, Vanessa. Girls, to many of you, you don't have stop. You don't have to keep running as you pass the ball. Come to a stop and deliver the ball. If you're 40 feet away from the pass you're making, going extra three feet on a... Stop. If you're 40 feet away from the pass you're throwing, going an extra three feet doesn't help you. Getting balanced and under control helps you. Got it? Play.
Pressure her. Pre pressures. Sprint into the screens. Precious, sprint into the screen. Sprint, then be self. Sprint, then be self. But no, she can put it in the backcourt. That's the rule. You have to learn to use your hands on defense. Your hands are right by your side. Your hands are by your side still. You have to have your hands active. Bella, you went up to, to Bella. You went up to help on defense, but you didn't see the ball. You just waved your arms. You have to see the ball. You don't have to. You can stay at this level defensively, but if you want to go to the next level, you have to see the ball. Stop! 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 stop. Show me where your hands are. No, no. They were down here. Are you challenging her at all? You're not. Yeah, girls, you don't have to buy into this. I'm not saying you do, but you're not going to be a good defensive player if you don't try. Everyone's hands are down here. No, you can't be down here. You've got to challenge the ball. Okay, let's go. Challenge the ball. Active hands. Active hands. Challenge the ball. See. Hey, no. Thank you. 
I, I think what precious precious listen I think if you take one dribble it's okay but keep facing the basket you can attack to the basket if you whirl back you're whirling into a double team all the time the help the help is there if you whirl you're going into the double team you, you don't need to do that Chloe, help her. Spread back. Just stop a second. She's just looking at whatever she wants to look at, Bella. 